Hey subscribers, I just wanted to share my latest purchase. It's a 1952 John Deere 60. I've always wanted one of these two cylinder John Deeres and this one came along at the right price. Sheet metal is really straight on this tractor. I like this one because it has the Rollomatic front end. So if this tire hits a rock or something, it'll lift up, leaving this one on the ground versus a regular tricycle front end where if you hit a rock with one tire, both of them lift up. Engine is 5.3 liters, so it's a big two cylinder. <laughs> I'm working on getting a three-point hitch for it. it. Mounts on here, and this lever activates it. I have the arms. I'm just missing a couple small parts. It's a good working tractor because this lever here activates the uh, clutch PTO. So if you're mowing or something, you can engage and disengage it at will. As you can see, it's a Pretty straight and honest working tractor. It had uh, weight racks on it for pulling and I took all those off. I have no interest in tractor pulling with it. So I'll start it up now. It's a six speed transmission with one reverse gear. This lever actually engages the PTO shaft inside the transmission and this one is the clutch for it, like I said earlier. Hand operated clutch throttle right here so start it up now if you're letting a John Deere sit here for a while running you always engage the clutch it lubricates the bearings and up in here properly tractors in order to use your three-point hitch or the PTO. You have to have the tractor off in order to turn your hydraulic pump on and to engage that for the PTO. I think they did this and that so when you're plowing fields you can leave them off and have as much power as possible for plowing. Sometimes to get this to engage you got to give the starter a little bump the ignition off. dummy plugs that go in here but you'll hear it load up so the hydraulics work at least of course you got two brake pedals one for each wheel make it steer sharper and parking brake on both sides one other feature I like about this tractor is this uses oil pressure to shut the fuel off so when it's running you'll see this open like that letting the fuel flow so if you turn it off there's no oil pressure it shuts the fuel off 
I mean, we have to think about it. Lots of people though have problems with them not working properly. This one seems to work fine. Once I get the three point hitch on it, I plan on putting a six foot finish mower behind it and see how it does mowing grass. And when that happens, I'll take another video and let everybody know how it does. Until next time, please like and subscribe to my channel.